shocking, wanted, Yahaya Bello receives bad news as wife's name is removed from list of judges approved for appointment. Listen to the news in full. The Nigerian Judicial Council, NJC, has removed Amina Bello, the wife of fugitive ex-governor Yahaya Bello, from the list of candidates for judgeship in the Kogi State High Court. This decision comes after significant legal and public outcry regarding a nomination given her husband's controversial legal issues. Yahaya Bello, the former governor of Kogi State, is currently embroiled in a series of corruption allegations. The Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, has charged him with money laundering, misappropriation, and breach of trust involving 84 billion naira. Bello, who is currently at large, is accused of conspiring with others to divert public funds for personal gain with transactions dating back to September 2015, shortly after he took office as governor. His wife, Amina, was shortlisted for a judicial position despite this allegation sparking widespread controversy and legal challenges. Seven senior advocates of Nigeria, SANS, initiated a lawsuit against the NJC and the Kogi state government over Amina Bello's nomination, arguing that the selection process violated constitutional principles of fairness, equity, and merit. The plaintiffs, including Chief Yunus Ustas Uzman and J.S. Okupet Okutepa, claimed that the process lacked transparency and disregarded the necessary qualifications and geographical balance required for judicial appointment. The controversy surrounding Amina Bello's nomination was further fueled by a letter from 17 sons from Kogi State. Who called for a subs suspension of new judicial appointment until the NJC addressed concerns about infrastructure and resource provisions for the judiciary. They highlighted the absence of candidates from Kogi East and Kogi West in the nominations, emphasizing that the list was skewed in favor of Kogi Central. The NJC's decision to drop Amina Bello was pu publicly confirmed by Prof. Chidi Odin Kalu, former chairman of the National Human Rights Commission, NHRC who described it as a victory for judicial integrity in Nigeria. The NJC ultimately approved four other candidate, candidates for the High Court of Kogi State, Joseph Sunday Ajesola, Ojoma Rachel Ojoma, Bahamas Kadiri, and Ezema Beatrice Ada. This decision represents a significant moment in the fight against corruption and the quest for a more transparent judicial appointment process in Nigeria. It underscores the importance of upholding the principles of fairness and merit in public service appointments, particularly within the judiciary, which plays a critical role in maintaining the rule of law. The removal of Amina Bello from consideration sends a clear message about the need for integrity and accountability in governance, especially in a state marred by allegations of significant financial misconduct. And this is the news for today, as we see that the wife of Yahaya Bello has been dropped from the list of judges that were to be recommended, that were to be recommended for the Kogi State High Court. And this serves as a way to show us that corruption will not be accepted in this nation. Don't forget to like this video, comment under this video, and subscribe to this channel to get more news from this channel.